Hey lovelies, today I have a selection of Christmas food and treats. So I really hope this will give you some inspiration. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. So now I'm going to show you what I've got. So if you want some more ideas after watching this video, then don't forget to check out my Christmas shopping video. So now I'm going to show you these right here. And these are um, a really great idea if you want to um, maybe jazz up your biscuit table. Um, for Christmas food and these are some gingerbread men but they're mini gingerbread men instead of your typical biscuits here they've got a range of um, like mini foods so this would be really cute and also very tasty and these are from Sainsbury's so some more foods from Sainsbury's include these here are some Lebkusten stars. So this is what they look like. And these are just some iced and sugared glazed mini cakes. So it says these are some iced and sugared glazed mini cakes with seasonal spice half um, coated in dark chocolate. So I couldn't help myself and I've actually had a bit of it already and I'll just show you what it looks like. So this is what the mini cake looks like and then the back here has some chocolate and you might have already actually eaten these before but not know the name of them. So this is a really great idea and they always go down well with lots of people during Christmas time. So it's very tasty and definitely you can taste that dark chocolate. So same foods haven't let me down and I've stocked up on some chips. So these are quite different and as you can see they're in lots of different colours. So not only that but they're in Christmas tree shapes and I thought that was so creative. And they're also gluten free. So this would be um, again, perhaps another tasty treat which would go down well with perhaps your family, friends or even yourself. So on the packet it says that these are lightly salted maize beetroot and spinach shaped tree snacks. Continuing on salty snacks, I've got now another packet um, and these are... Um, some maple bacon flavoured festive um, pretzels. So here they are. And I mean, they're quite a decent size. So on the packet, it just describes them as maple bacon flavoured wheat and potato um, pretzels. So these are in the shapes stars, trees and bells. Yeah, as you can see on the packet, you can see those star shapes. Can you do Christmas food without the traditional mince pies so here is just some Sainsbury's um, mince pies so these have an ice topping so as you can see these this is the picture and when I saw this I just had to buy them they look so tasty and on the top they have soft white fondant icing so these are some normal mince pies except the top is replaced with an ice topping and I think that these are really tasty and um, again, we'll just add a little bit of different but still bring that traditional. A lot of the Sainsbury's food is vegetarian free, but of course, just check on the back. Now I have for you guys um, one of my faves and that is Mr. Kipling. And this year they have the festive Bakewells. So this is them just here. And I think that these are such a pretty um, snack. And it's just got some sprinkles. And um, yeah, that's just the inside. So I love Bakewells. And if you want to see more, then definitely check out my food shopping. And you'll see a range of their other Christmas selection. So after all those chips and cakes, you get thirsty. And a Christmas drink which... I could recommend at Christmas and all year round is cranberry juice. So here is just the Asda cranberry juice drink and it's high in vitamin C. 
So I just here have a carton. So cranberry juice is great for refreshing the palates and also just a tasty drink. So this is brilliant during the festive time and also throughout the year. So another festive drink is mulled wine. So this is described as a rich and warming mulled wine crafted with the finest festive flavours to give an aromatic blend of cinnamon, nutmeg, clove, spice and zingy citrus fruits. So it has within it zesty aromatic orange and it also has cinnamon and other spices. And here's just a look at the back. So if you want to make some mulled wine at home, then a great idea is to buy this. So this right here is the mulled wine spice and in here just contains the spices which you would use to um, make your mulled wine tasty and perhaps uh, in a pot at home. So this is just another idea and definitely something you could add to your shopping list. Christmas cake. Christmas cake is such a traditional Christmas um, food and dessert and here I have the Asda free from um, wheat and gluten Christmas cake so here it is here so they are all within individual packets and sliced in this box and it's great for sharing so if you like raisins and spice then Christmas um, cake is for you this is a great Christmas cake and this is from Asda. So if you like toppings on your cake, I haven't forgotten the brandy sauce and this is from Birds. So here's a little bit of a look. So if you want an alternative to custard, this is a great one and this brandy sauce is ready to serve. If you are a Christmas pudding addict or you haven't been Christmas puddinged out yet, I have another addition and that is here the extra special free from um, Christmas pudding and this is great because it's been um, matured for six months and it looks like so so I think they put a bit more care into the making of this one and they've just put that extra extra by maturing it for a little bit longer for a great taste and it's in a tiny box. So this is um, something perhaps you could bring to someone um, for Christmas day or maybe even just an individual snack. So I saw these when I was Christmas shopping and these are just some Pringles. And these are just in a Christmas packaging. And on the back, they just show other varieties. Here I have some Ferrero Rochers. And these would perhaps be great as a gift to someone or a stocking filler. And I thought it would be um, not a Christmas shop without kind of adding these. So I've showed you quite a bit of sweet and savoury snacks. Um, but I have a bit of real food and that is this right here. So this is the two king prawns and this is a puff pastry. So inside it just has some prawns, cheese and other stuff. This is from Sainsbury's and two come in a packet. Not forgetting the spices. So here I just have some ginger and some mixed grounded spice and these two spices are very Christmassy and I thought I'd add those also to my shopping list. So right here I have Nutella and this is in Christmas packaging so if you like your favourite foods such as Nutella they definitely will have a lot of them in Christmas packaging although it is the typical formula inside. And the traditional biscuit tins so here I have some traditional biscuit tins and they just always have um, these out during Christmas time so you can get ones which are really really cute or you can just get the normal variety so these biscuits are great just to have perhaps around or you could even gift them 
So right here are just some extras I bought which I wanted to include. So right here I've got the Clementine juice and this isn't from Concentrate so this is a brilliant festive drink. I've got some mixed fruit here and this is going to be brilliant for baking and including with other festive treats. And I've got some cheese here. So this is the cathedral cheese which is lactose free and it's mature cheddar. So this will be perfect for your cheese board. So thank you for watching my Christmas food edition. I really hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.